beauty so today i want to show you secret of making black soap i want to show you those heads you can actually add inside your black soap that will fight reaction fight black spot fight eczema fight all kind of skin diseases and at the same time they will make your soap to be very very effective so if this is the video you love to watch just stick to this video to the end do not skip the advert though those people so subscribe to my youtube channel like and share my video do not forget to turn on the notification bell below like i am coming out with plenty content this january so please do not forget to turn on the notification bell below so that you'll be notified each time i upload a video so you've been making soap and your client are still complaining about pimples that means you are not getting it right you've been making soap your client are still complaining of eczema you, you are not getting it right like my black soap is the best seller when it comes to my skincare products among all my skincare products my black soap i have people that buy black soap in 20 containers that buy black soap in 5 kg that buy black soap in 20 kg and many more because my black soap work it works fire even for my own acne my own face like i massage my black soap on my face Eh? five minutes before i have my bath and it works fire it eradicates my pimples it clears eczema i don't even have anything eczema on my skin or rashes i've never ever experienced rashes even after childbirth when you see some people having rashes and all that i don't experience it my kids don't experience it that's because there are some heads i had into my black soap and i'll be reviewing those heads with you i'll be telling you about this head so just watch the video to the end you want to step up your game your black soap game you want to start making effective black soap you want to make black soap that works very well you have to watch this video this video is for you so do not skip and yes our skincare training is ongoing our online skincare training is ongoing you want to learn skincare product how to make them from scratch that is natural skincare formulation or you want to learn how you can actually promix you know do promixing with organic you know semi promixing or you want to learn semi um natural skincare formulation yeah i put it like that because any skincare formulation you made and you added something is no longer natural you've gone out of natural <laughs> let's say maybe we can rate it 60 percent natural right or we rate it 50 percent natural 50 percent pro me so yes you want to learn natural skincare promising class is ongoing just send us a whatsapp message to the number you're seeing up there on the screen so secret of making effective black soap reviewed i'm going to be revealing it to you now okay so now you're making black soap and your client are still complaining you know it's not supposed to be like that we call it herbal black soap so it should be herbal there are some heads you have to add to your black soap now i'll be talking about most of these eggs number one of this egg i don't joke with this egg is my aloe vera powder i don't joke with it okay i had aloe vera powder to my black soap very very important fine i'm going to be reviewing like um 12 of those herbs now it's not much you should add 12 12 is too much so at the end of the day your, the, your soap will not be help your soap will not uh sorry your soap will not stop laddering okay so you just have to select um among those herbs you can use like five okay you can do like five or six but you have to have them in little little percentage uh, probably one one percent zero point five percent you can see combine everything okay when you combine a lot of herbs it works ah it works so you can still combine everything but you have to work with a certain percentage so you can do 0 0.5 0 0.5 i'm just giving you guys scope oh, this is what you should pay for so now my aloe vera powder very very important i don't joke with my aloe vera powder this goes into my black soup aloe vera powder treats eczema itchy skin very very good for moisturizing the skin good for dry skin so aloe vera powder is just an antibiotic on its own number two powder i don't want this video to be very very long number two powder i don't miss tamarind powder like this powder is fire oh my god this powder is the powerhouse of vitamin c antioxidant eh so you're having skin irritations you're having skin rashes, skin everything any kind of skin problem you're having just had this to suit your irritations is very very okay very very good this herb do not joke with it all right very very okay so another herb i'll be talking about is our baobab powder so this is baobab okay 
this is actually a fruit okay this is also another power us out of vitamin c it helps boost the elasticity of your skin it helps fight um aging sagging skin it, it helps firm the skin it helps fight uh wrinkles it boosts collagen so this is very very good very very good for inflammation very very good for um clearing spots because anything that contains vitamin c is very very good antioxidant is very very good for clearing spots so baobab powder very very important and very 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 good like i had to just take my time and list out this powders for you guys so another one which you and i know is our one and only dongoyaro neem powder this is neem powder like if you're not using neem powder in your black soap i wonder what you're using this will treat your eczema it will treat your ringworm it will treat your uh, your 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 you know um dark spots it will treat your acne your pimples you can actually use this any of these powders you can combine them and make a max with them when you're making a max you just add in either bentonite clay or you had in uh, kaolin clay and you are done with your max you just package i've given you another recipe oh no 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 yeah so you can combine all this for acne skin irritation eczema and make a max okay but watch the video to the end because i have a whole lot of interesting herbs i am revealing so your um Neem powder treats acne, dandruff, eczema, ringworm, clear spot. So very, very important in your black soup. Now, like I was saying, you have to uh, work at a certain percentage. And I've, I think I've mentioned the percentage you should work in and I've explained to you. So now, depending on your own formulation skill, you want to freestyle, you want to remove one and hard one. It also depends on you. And that is why when I say come and learn skincare, you have to learn because... And most of the times you want to do some things on your home but since you have uh, the basic knowledge or once you've had a basic knowledge about formulation things will be very very easy for you so another herbal powder we're talking about is our cinnamon powder hi 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 my secret ingredient cinnamon powder i don't joke with cinnamon powder oh my god it will treat acne hyperpigmentation reduces any sign of aging it boosts collagen it grows your skin it makes your skin so lovely like cinnamon powder if you don't add this into your black soap i wonder what you've been adding into your black soap so this is one good ingredient herb you need in your black soap so yes another one i'll be talking about is my one and only zobo powder which is called abiscus powder this is abiscus powder if you don't have this into your black soap or if you don't make marks with this i wonder what you've been producing like i wonder what you've been producing so this is a powerhouse of antioxidants of vitamin c eh? it helps to clear your acne it helps to exfoliate your skin it helps to clear your eczema your rashes it helps to clear pimples it gives you a flawless beautiful skin and it brightens your skin this is also good for anti-aging it brightens and glows your skin i have made a max on my channel using this so you can just go and watch out for that max so add this into your black soap and come back to thank me so i don't want to waste my time another one that people don't usually talk about is your enna powder do you know that if you're making black soap you're making shower gel you're making face masks you can actually work with your enna okay you're you're doing a you, you you own a spa you're you, you you know you do facials you do acne treatments what are you doing without enna powder you need enna powder people don't talk about this it is very very effective i've used all those powders they are effective if they are not effective i will not come and tell you they are very very effective so what does enna do enna suit bones you are suffering from sunburn you can make a mask with yogurt with milk with this apply on your face it reduces eczema and inflammation if you're having any kind of inflammation on your skin you're having eczema you can actually use this enna powder it is very 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 it is very very effective now this one i want to talk about if you don't use it i wonder what you've been i wonder where you've been in this world if you've never heard of willow back like white willow back hey god i think you remember called this igyaun something igyaun yeah but it is called white willow back you know we are meant to believe from our research we are meant to believe and yes that salicylic acid is being derived from 
white willow tree or willow tree or willow bark okay so now this is going to help to treat your sunburn to suit any skin irritation is an anti-inflammatory it is an anti-bacteria it is also is an antibiotic it heals your acne hey you are making acne soap acne face wash acne whatever or you are doing black soap you don't have this your clients will always come back you know that in black soap we cannot have two cream uh we cannot have skin good we cannot have any cream to start fighting uh, sunburn uh, to start fighting pimples or fight eczema these are heads that you will have when you had willow back your clients will never complain nobody will come and tell you any story what you'll be hearing is that ah madam my face is clearing my pimples is clearing my pimples is drying up that, that those are the kind of story you'll be hearing i don't know why i'm even saying all this like i'm just i'm just giving you guys my all my all my secret my brand secret another one that you need is also turmeric powder hey god if you're not using turmeric powder i wonder what you've been using Turmeric is an antioxidant, anti-inflammatory. It glows the skin. It brightens the skin. If you're not using this well, I know you're using it because everybody, but you know, everybody, everybody on the street of YouTube, even the ones that are formulated, that are not from that are not formulated. Everybody uses turmeric, even when they don't even know what it does. They use turmeric. So yes, turmeric is very very okay. It helps calm irritations. It helps to glow the skin very very okay you can also make a max with your turmeric so, so another one i'll be talking about is coffee beans hey god if you're not adding coffee beans into your black soup then what are you adding you know you need to add something that will help to shed dead skin cells coffee beans shed dead skin cells coffee beans exfoliates the skin it removes dead skin cells coffee beans is also good for treating acne coffee beans is also good for treating stretch mark it helps reduce cellulite so add so add coffee beans into your black soap you can make this uh, make a match with this you can also add this into your face wash your body wash okay and you're going to love the results another one I'll be talking about is your calm wood powder or your sandalwood if you're not using this too then what are you using what have you been using what kind of black soap have you been making so this is my calm wood i don't joke without my eh i don't joke with my calm wood my calm wood and sandalwood i don't joke with them hey god calm wood will treat your acne it will remove your spots it will grow your skin it will give you smooth skin it helps to boost collagen all right sandalwood also the same thing sandalwood is i think some sandalwood is is the international calm wood over there okay this one is our local calm wood yeah you can find it very much in africa plenty yeah like in india you know the sandalwood is their own okay sandalwood remove dark spots it brightens the skin i will not assure you that it lightens the skin forget those uh, DIY, you will see they'll tell you sandalwood whiten the skin is a lie. Sandalwood will not whiten the skin, it can it, it can clear, give you a clearer skin over time, like months, you know. Yeah, it can brighten the skin a bit. It's not really really brightening, but it's you know, it yeah, it's depending on skin type, you know, our skin type, the way our skin responds to uh, uh, ingredients. Yeah, to some people, it can brighten them some people they might not really notice that brightening but when it comes to removing acne treating the skin any skin impediment any skin problem you're having it to eradicate it to glow your skin in combination with other herbs and um, other omectants you're adding of course calm wood and sandal wood you need them in your black soup do not do without this in your black soup all right so please make your black soup with all these ingredients i have listed to you if you cannot use everything you can use everything depending on how you write your recipe let me just tell you so that you don't go and mess up your formulas you can use them at 0.5 uh, percent each each you can do six out of them you can you you have explained what each and every one of them does the benefits it gives to the skin so take your time listen to this video not the ones you can select or you can do them 0.5 you know when you combine two 0 0.5 together that is one gram or one sorry one percent so
so you just know a way to go about it if you don't know how to convert recipes from percentage to gram you can enroll for our basic skincare class it is very very cheap it's the cheapest if you don't want to do the advanced skincare class so you just have to have ideas so that most of the things i drop on my channel you will understand uh, most time i come to my channel the videos i make i make them to help formulators like me and uh, at times even you that you're not a formulator in case you want to make your product yourself but at times you need a little brush up and i might not be chance to come and start doing all that yeah so if you want to enroll for the class just send a whatsapp message to the number you're seeing up there on the screen so thank you so much i really hope you enjoyed this video so see you in my next video make your black so give me review use all these ingredients just use them for like a week okay and if you're using all these herbs please it's all these herbs they are not magic share they are not magic please if you're used, making your black soap number one make sure that your black soap is balanced the ph is balanced so that it does not irritate your skin now after you're done with your soap you've uh, formulated a ph balanced soap good soap with good ingredients eh? then if you're using this so you have to massage on the skin and leave for like five minutes so that the hair will enter your skin and work if you did not leave you just enter wash and wash it off the hair will not work you have to let it sit on your skin if you can leave it for 10 minutes and you're the type of the skin type that can accept black soap for 10 minutes leave it let it work okay so thank you so much see you in my next video bye